Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Thank you for always stopping by. In today's video, I want to share with us what you should drink if you're experiencing movement of objects in your body, if you're under serious spiritual attack. If the attack is inside your body, it makes you uncomfortable. At times, it comes in form of headache. At times, it comes in form of arrows. At times, it comes in form of objects moving all over your body. At times, it comes in form of hotness of the body. You've done so many things. You've taken so many medications and you still feel the same. You've done so many spiritual work and you still feel the same. I am here today to share with us a leaf. You should just drink the water and by the grace of God, your story will never remain the same. I made a video concerning alum and potash with eggshell. If you've not watched that video or you've not done that video, please go back and do it. Then back it up with this one and see how those evil people living in your society, living in your community, living in your compound, living in your family will be exposed. This is magic. It works like magic. Yes. So this is an ancient secret I'm about to reveal to every one of us listening to me and watching my video. So if you feel any kind of movement in your body that you feel that is spiritual, is not ordinary, please, this recipe will work for you 100%. But you need to have faith and do exactly as I want to share with us. So the thing you need to do for me is to get your water leave. This is my water leaf. I know most of us used to use it in preparing our soup. Yes, use it to prepare your vegetable soup, your alfalfa soup, your idikaiko. You can learn the soup you use it to prepare. This water leaf is medicinal and is spiritual. Okay? So some people will say they don't plant it. The thing will just grow on this zone. Yes, it's a miracle leaf. It germinates on this zone like weed. But when you eat, when, but it's not weed, it's something you can consume, unlike other weeds that grow in your compound. God created this for so many purposes. So if you've been using it to cook soup alone, watch today's video and know that there are other things you can do with what I leave other than preparing soup with it. What is that thing you need to do with it? To fight spiritual battles. Yes. Before I talk about movement of the objects, if you have any kind of skin infection, you can see how my skin is shining. If you have any kind of skin infection, just boil this water leaf. Don't, you don't need to pick out the leaves. Just boil it with a stem like this. Just wash it, boil it, and use the water to take your bath. It can add a little salt to it after boiling it. Use it to take your bath. Don't use any soap. Just use it like that. Just keep scrubbing on the affected part of your body that you want to treat, that you feel that you have that infection, you will see it, you will see how your system will change immediately. Then people that have odor in their VG, the women that have odor, okay, in their private parts, you can use it to treat it. That will be in the part two if you're interested. So let me concentrate on today's topic. So now when you get your water leaf, this time around, remember you're going to drink it. So you have to wash it thoroughly you can cook it with a stem, but make sure that there is no sand attached to it. Just cut off the dirty part of it, wash it thoroughly, and boil with clean water and drink. But if you cannot do that style, the way I usually tell people to do it, the perfect way to do it is washing it. As when you wash it, just do as if you're, you want to remove the water of the water leaf with just little water. Wash out the water and drink it on an empty stomach. Immediately you wake up, you wash it and strain out the water and drink it it will be very dry but please forget about it you can hold your nose and drink it in the night you do the same thing just do it for like seven days you will see how your system will change it's going to wash everything in your system it might pour you if you have a very light stomach but it works wonders those moving objects in your body it is going to touch them anywhere they are and it will go out like a scritter. It will go out like urine. This is how powerful this water leaf is. Then for those that their own comes like arrows. If you feel your own comes like. After boiling, after sieving out, after washing it to drink the water. Then you boil another one and use it to take your bath. That one you are going to boil it with salt. 
use it to take your baths. As your perfume, as your pattern, please remember to speak. What I mean by speaking, pray. Tell God anywhere these arrows are coming from. From the east, from the west, from the north, from the south. From your mother's side, from your father's side, from your place of work, from your place of business, from your compound where you live, from your neighbors, from your friends, you don't want to know. Like only said, I'm not interested to know where my problem is coming from. What I'm interested in is the solution to that my problem. Okay? So tell God that you don't want to know where the arrow is coming from. What you're interested in is how to destroy that evil arrows of the enemies. That God should fight your battle using this natural leaf. That as you drink and bet with it, that wherever it's coming from, let it return back to sender. That let it leave your system. Your system is not permitted to accept anything evil again as from today. Your system is not ready and will not accept anything diabolic, anything demonic again. That you, you have decided to set yourself free from every, uh, every works of the enemies towards you. Every works of the witches towards you. Every manipulation of the enemies towards you. At times you start experiencing this moment of death after eating in the dream. They have come to poison you spiritually. And if care is not taken, physically you will be sick. You'll be completely done that they will take you from one hospital to another, from one prayer house to another, and this thing will still be there. So use this method to cleanse your system, both physically and spiritually. Apart from the spiritual uses of this, as you're drinking it, it is going to cleanse your every part of your body. All your organs will be clean. And please, if you have diabetes, this is very, very good for you. It is going to help reduce your sugar level. Even people with di uh, high blood pressure, this works perfectly for you. So as you're drinking it, just be less assured that God is going to do a thorough cleansing, both physically and spiritually, as you take this water, leave water. Remember the two methods I taught us. You can boil and drink the water when it's warm. You can actually wash the, the leaf with little water, strain out the water and drink it. That one, you get the original green uh, of this. That is, that one is the one I always recommend. In as much as the boiling one is easier. Many people will prefer that one. But if you can do this washing and straining out the water, that one works perfectly. And it will give you instant result. So let me know when you try it by sharing your testimony under the comment section or on my WhatsApp number. I've come to the end of today's video. Thank you for watching. And if you've not subscribed... Please do so, so that you learn everything you need to know about health and spiritualism. And if you're a returning subscriber, you know I appreciate that. Keep supporting the channel by liking my videos and sharing my videos. Thank you once again, and see you in my next one. Bye-bye.